The locals were none too happy to see us here. Looks like after the war they created a veritable technophobic cult here. And its leader managed to trap me in their half-flooded church. I have no idea what they would have done to me had they actually captured me. But with the aid from a woman called Katya, the cultist had been keeping imprisoned here. I managed to give them the slip. After all those years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly fresh, intoxicating. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from the government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they? while we were eating each other alive in the metro. We'll have a lot of questions for them once we reach Yamantau, if we reach it. The ruins of our country are under enemy control, according to Miller, and we'll have to fight through to our goal. A small team against the occupation armies? Let's warm you up a little bit. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life, the life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the bridge! Shots fired! Four bogeys on a trolley! Mohan, report to the bridge! On the double! Are you alright, Tatyom? Yeah. The beast is silver. How bad is it? Can we move? No, we're stuck! Ah, oh, shit! Damn fog. Seems we ran through someone's roadblock. Who was it? Any uniforms? None. They were wearing rags. Just some old farts. Old farts, huh? That's just the perimeter guard. They couldn't put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we can't be sure. I was expecting to run into them much earlier. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. This looks peaceful. A village and a church on the water. We need intel. Here, Artyom. I put a mark on your map. Get there and find out what you can about that breach. Taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. May I go with Artyom too? As backup? No. Until we figure out our situation, you are not to take a step away from the Aurora. These two can handle themselves just fine. Yermak, when can you get the Aurora running again? Yeah, I don't know yet. Let's go, Artyom. I see. Get to it then. Artyom, don't forget your backpack. It's a new model. A portable workshop, so to speak. The manual is inside. It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for those. Let's move out, Artyom. Just be careful out there. Sure thing. I gotta say, that was one flimsy roadblock. 
And those guys, well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Be careful out there. Remember, most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Even those who speak our language might be enemies, by conviction or out of fear. Got it? Do you hear that bell? We must have given them a good scare. Maybe they served the enemy, enslaved or something. Going down. Ha, <laughs> that was great. That electric tower there looks like a perfect sniping position. Let's go.
Okay, Artyom, I'll climb up there while you take the boat to the church. I'll call you when I'm settled. Break a leg. Salantius has already started his sermon. Just enter the temple and see the light of truth. We are a peaceful lot, so please keep your weapons. Dwellers won't even talk to heretics, but I'll tell you everything I've seen Our in this place all that year. Under the cover of fog. Oh, it's the bridge guard. Silentia has fooled them just like the locals, but unlike them, the bridge guard have guns. Run! There's a way out down here, and there's a boat at the dock. We also have one, but it's too small for all of us. Our job should try to get to the boat. We'll rescue her later. Don't worry. Just stay here, really. 
Artyom, I can't cover you when you're inside. I'm changing position to meet the woman and child. I know you can handle this just fine. He just vanished, that demon! Have you seen the heretic sister? So you have seen him? Has the hidden been found yet? He's not here, holy fuck! Keep looking! The heretic is still in here! So, did you see him or not? I don't get it. I'm sorry, we were just looking for him and we... Ah, forget it. So, did you see him or not? I don't get it. Quit bothering me! What do you care if I saw him? There was a heretic in the church! For a sin! We need to pray it away, and you are distressing us! I, I'm sorry, we were just looking for him, and we... Ah, forget it. Go then, do the worthy deed. The Satan's spawn were not satisfied destroying the old world. So no doubt, they want to bring their filth into our cloister. <coughs> <coughs>
was always like this. So quiet. So good. Good will to man. Come on, you dirty spawn of Satan! Come out and don't tempt these men anymore! Are you sure that was a heretic? Well, what else? The heretic is still Satan. There, in the passage. Did someone else see that? What's that movement over there? service to the true faith. Which fortify my soul. Uh, I think there's something in that passage, brethren.
You heretic! Lord, save me! Did you come here to take a look at our life? It's not so great. Fish be my witness. We've but one protector. Our holy father, Salantius. And it's by his prayers they're still alive. As if we didn't have enough milk in the electric. Are you sure that was a heretic? Now the bandits are up on us. Where else? Those who let us live or die in peace. I say it was Satan who was such. You must have passed through the bandits to get a body. And you will leave them? Now. Well, they say that as soon as Father Salentius finished his sermon, there was a flash of Paris light and the heretic just vanished. Come on, you heretic! <laughs> I order you by the name of Holy Salentius himself! No, but Come on, and the let the true faith purify your soul of sin! Seduced by the heretics, get spoiled in water than women in oil, men in sulfur. And you believe them? That machine only has coal and water. All right, let's go look for him then. Grab him by the tail or horns when you find him. <laughs> Lord, protect me. It was here. There's no doubt about that. Empty. Ah, it was nothing after all. Ah, the burden of our sins. of Satan! Come out and don't tempt these men anymore! Where are those heathens? I can't wait any longer to do nothing.
the hidden been found yet? Not yet. Uh, so Search for him. Here. I can Got feel you. his presence. While the heretics are already in our cloister. <laughs> I sure hope we drive them out. Well, all fates are in God's hand. sin of negligence of my duty, intentional or unintentional. Those filthy, throwing cans all over the place. There's nothing. Come out your hell spawn. Repent, confess your sins, and that will count in your favor when the judgment day comes. Have you found him yet? Or should I look for him myself, brethren? Who's yet? Who's walking over the way? We have to find him, my children! Some shall I will show you the spot now. It would be nice to miss the morning mass. You can do that if you're on a patrol duty. And again, people don't like that. <laughs> Who's there?
You're going to face the Lord Beresonia, dog! The heard you scare!
kill a thing you'd be hiding like a rat before you die? <laughs> this is the fate that awaits for your dark master. Satan, come out and face me! Listen, you heretic pig! Do you think Heidi will help you? Not a chance! The wrath of our Lord will consume your soul! Who shall be saved? I give up. I have no choice but to rely on your mercy, even though you are a heretic.
was starting to worry. You raised some hell in there. Ah, oh, well. Artyom, Katya, and Nastya are with me now. See you aboard the Aurora. Check the map. Looks like you can row straight to it from there. What the fuck was that? A whale? It's fucking huge! The old man sent me out as a forward sentry. Told me that I was to sit tight and under no circumstances look for any action. So I just had a From the abyss of NATO You're occupation. alive! <laughs> Thank you for the information, Katya. But there is one more question I need to ask. But of course. What do you know of the occupation forces? Huh? I'm sorry, I don't quite get what you... So, you've never seen any foreign army in this area? No, I haven't seen any army. But we haven't really been to any important places. I see. Hmm. Artyom, a moment. Thank you, Artyom. If not for you, we'd never have escaped that place. Artyom, stop by my desk once you're you. done talking to the old man. I've got something for you. Great job saving them, Artyom. Katya here has provided us with vital information. A mechanic called Crest is hiding in the port. His help is required if we are to fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Yaramak can't handle the repairs alone. So once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. And then get back ASAP. We'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. 
Now we know for sure that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. Well, at least some things are clearer now. But still, so many questions. There might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably get us in the key regions only. In any case, we'll learn everything once we reach Yamantau. From the top source. The Moscow government is essentially a local council, to put things in perspective. So, now we just need to figure out how to cross this goddamn bridge. Yes, Uncle How do you like the backpack? Is it comfortable? Can you operate stealthily with it? Thank you, Auntie I have a present for you here. A Tihar rifle. Ring any bells? It's pneumatic, but it still pecks a wallop. Plus, making bullets for it is easy as pie, even in the field. Just remember to keep that pressure up, otherwise you might as well be spitting him out yourself. Other than that, it will never fail you. I did my best. So, bear it with honor. <laughs> and don't forget to drop by from time to time. I have a few ideas for improving it. There you go, Artyom. As I always said, you lucked out with me. We all lucked out with Anna. She's a total dead eye. Now I only wish your mom could come with us too. With a real medic, we'd become unstoppable. <laughs> <laughs> Katya, Nastya, come have some tea. Don't Artyom, uh, I took some measurements. There is one hell of a radioactive hotspot between this place and the port. The regions are off the scale. So you better take a boat. We found one and docked it under the bridge. Well, unless you're afraid of the monster. Duke told us over the radio. <laughs> Artyom? Afraid? Bullshit. Besides, the monster is just a catfish. After the nuking, the fallout got washed off into the rivers and settled down as sediment. Catfish are bottom dwellers, so they got hit worst. But this one wasn't so bad, by the way. I was careful and never got attacked. I, I don't think it will attack if you keep quiet. It's no alligator, after all. By the way, did you see any of those? Uh, back in the States, I mean. It's not like they were all over the place there, like bears in Russia. Thank you. You know? Though I've been to Florida once and visited an So, Katya, where are you uh, from? Artyom, are you going to the port? I am going to relieve Alyosha now, so I can't come with you. His hand is still giving him trouble. Hi, Artyom. Hello again, Artyom. You did great out there. Or so everyone says. <laughs> in the meantime, we have dug in here. We've been waiting for the occupying forces. But so far, we have only seen winged and four-legged <laughs> ones. <laughs> Our ecology seems to sit badly with them. 